pop-ups, building them is now even more simple. We just need two lines to build them. And for that, start by creating a button to open the pop-up. Next add an element for the pop-up and mention its ID as shown. Then add an attribute called popover, which will convert the element into a pop-up and hides it by default. Next, for the button element, add an attribute called popover target and mention its value as pop-up. We can see the pop-up being displayed when the button is clicked and it gets hidden when clicked anywhere else on the screen. These are the two lines needed to build the pop-up. If needed, you can set its position as required. Also set its background, font properties and also apply a smooth animation effect as shown. We can also include a cancel or close button. For that create a button inside the pop-up element and set the pop over target attribute, then set the pop over target action attribute to hide. We can see the pop-up's close button here. And this feature is compatible with all the major browser. If you find this tutorial valuable then subscribe to the channel.